What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here, and today we're going to go over a quick way to defragment your hard drives, and also debunk some hard drive defragmentation myths in terms of solid state drives. So first things first, we're just going to go straight to the defragmenter. We can click on our start menu in Windows 10 and type in defrag, and you'll see defragment and optimize drives. And um, you'll see that we have the option to analyze and optimize. Um, on all drives, it should say the same thing, analyze and optimize. And um, you're first going to want to analyze it, and that'll tell you how fragmented the drive is. You can see this one's 2% fragmented. And then once it determines that, you're going to want to click on optimize, and that's when it's actually going to do the defragmentation process and have you restart your computer. And it's as easy as that. Now, there is some um, back and forth going on as to whether this actually helps um, with solid state drives. And the answer is yes and no. Um, the thing is, defragmentation will not help a solid state drive. There's even some um, data that shows that it might shorten the lifespan of a solid state drive. However, Windows knows this. And instead of using the regular defragmentation process when we click on optimize, if it detects a solid state drive, it actually um, runs the trim process, which is a process made for solid state drives and optimizes their delivery instead of using a regular defragmentation process. So um, yes, you can use the defragmentation tool, which is now called Optimized Drives, which I believe they named it that for a reason. They're moving away from the term defragmentation. Um, and you can use it on solid state drives as well. But no, traditional defragmentation will not help in solid state drive performance. I uh, hope this cleared up some of the myths and um, facts going around. And I hope this helped you optimize your drives. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day. Peace. Hey guys, thanks for watching that video. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. We also now have a join button, so you can now join our membership for $1.99 to get access to all of our live streams, or $4.99 to get your name in your videos um, as a supporter. So in all of the videos that I release, you'll get your name at the end of the video as a supporter. Um, we also have uh, Stream Savers, which is now available for pre-order and the beta is now working. Stream Savers is a gotcha style um, RPG idle clicker game that lives in your um, live stream. So if you stream on Twitch, you can actually have uh, your audience interact with your characters on, on screen and even drop into the game themselves um, in PvP mode. So it's a pretty cool application and we recently got picked up by uh, Streamlabs OBS to release on their app store as well. So if you're a Prime member, you may actually get that for free soon. Uh, but yeah, thank you again for watching the video and um, do any and all of those things that I mentioned. Uh, yeah, love you guys. Have a great one. Peace.